Culturing green water to feed to your Daphnia is pretty easy if you do it outdoors. However, it can be difficult to do that without culturing mosquitoes. But in cold weather, it's necessary to do it indoors if you want to keep it going. So you can order the preferred species of unicellular free-floating algae that I understand Daphnia magna prefer is Chlorella vulgaris and you can order a culture of that off of eBay or Amazon. Now there are videos and sites that will sell culturing stations for green water but most of those are quite expensive. But really all you need is the fertilizer. And the cheapest fertilizer that I know of is called Osmocote. But it comes in these pellets that are quite hard. So the way to deal with that is to pulverize them with a mortar and pestle. Once you've pulverized the osmocote, you can mix it with water to get it in solution. And as I understand it, it's also necessary to add a little bit of sodium chloride. Now obviously you want to get non-iodized salt. I purchase sodium chloride in bulk and mix it up on a regular basis to hatch brine shrimp nopoly. But you don't want to go for brine here. You just want to add a tiny bit of sodium chloride. So here's sodium chloride in solution. Just a little bit to add to the fertilizer for the chlorella vulgaris. And since this water has nutrient in it, you want to keep it refrigerated. So I'll put it in a plastic container, keep it refrigerated and labeled to fertilize my green water. And here is the result. After a few weeks the water should turn nice and green and you'll have loads of Chlorella vulgaris to feed to your Daphne Magna. You're going to want to keep your Chlorella vulgaris suspended. So I've taken a lid here and made it to fit this air wand. Fashion that to stay in place in the pickle jar. And here I have small culture of Daphnia magna. I add the green water to that culture. Now the Daphnia in the fertilized culture should explode and I'll simply top off my green water culture with the chlorinated water and add the fertilizer. Now resume aerating the green water with the air wand and that should keep the free floating algae in suspension. It has light from below on a 12 hour cycle and in a few weeks it should propagate very well.